So I used to be a big excuse maker. I used to run around making excuses for why I couldn't talk to girls, why I couldn't make approaches. And what I wanna tell you guys in this video is, and I wanna give you guys in this video are three really powerful mindset tools that have helped me overcome my own excuses. And a couple of these are gonna be practical and one's gonna be more ephemeral. I want you to change how you think about the world. But no matter what, if you care about getting results, getting more dates, I want you to stick around, watch the video, take some fucking notes, listen up, let's get into it. So the first mindset that you guys gotta understand is that you don't know how the interaction is gonna go, okay? And this keeps so many guys, so many guys from actually making the first approach. You are so in your ego, you're so full of yourself and think you're so right that this girl would never like me, this girl's probably like this, this girl's probably like that. You're just intellectualizing all these excuses that you never actually give yourself the chance to meet an amazing woman. A lot of red pill guys are like this. I don't know if you noticed, but red pill guys love to talk about how women are without actually talking to women. And it's because if you can intellectualize why women are not shit, why you don't want to talk to them, why they're useless, why they don't offer any value. If you can do that, then you don't have to talk to them and you can avoid the discomfort of getting rejected. You can avoid the pain of realizing, man, my game sucks. <laughs> my game is dog shit. And that's what most red pill guys are on. That's the type of bullshit that they're on. So what I want you to do the next time you see a girl that you want to approach, I want you to listen to all the things that you're telling yourself about what you think she's like, who you think she is. And I want you to let go of that and just go find out. Try to go find out if those things are true. So that girl with the super bitchy face that looks like she'd be so fucking rude to you. What I want you to do is I want you to focus on, okay, let's go find out. Let's go find out if she is. I don't know. Drop the ego, drop all the know-it-all bullshit. Okay, you don't fucking know. Go find out, all right? That's the first thing I want you guys to do next time you see a girl you wanna to talk to. The next strategy that I've used before, and this is actually like a really funny strategy, it's to get you to let go of taking yourself so seriously and just have fun and uh, look at your excuses like a funny little challenge rather than something that is really holding you back. And I think that's, that's actually really important. That's been very important on my own journey. So the next time you have an excuse that comes up, I want you to imagine in the future, okay? You have children, the mother of your children, right? You're talking to her, she's beautiful, she's amazing. Most amazing woman you've ever met, makes you feel so good, so whole, most wholesome relationship of all time, okay? It's perfect, all right? And I want you to explain to that woman why you didn't approach her. Whether it's, oh, well, I was wearing a winter coat and I was a little warm, and I was a little, I was a little sweaty, or oh, it was a little cold outside, I didn't, I didn't wanna bother you. Oh, that woman would be pissed at you. She'd be pissed because she wants to meet you. She wants to meet you because you are her ideal guy. You are her ideal match. And you never met her because you didn't give it a shot. Or even think about it like this. I didn't approach 50 to 60 or 100 women so I could build the skill set to meet my future wife. Imagine explaining that to her as well. Like, hey, I didn't do all the things that I was supposed to do so that I could have the skills to meet you. She would be so mad at you. Why would you do that to the future mother of your children? Why would you let that happen to your future wife? You are actively hurting relationships in the future that don't even exist yet because you have excuses, because you think you know everything. You think you know how the interaction is going to go. You don't want to talk to her because of X, Y, Z reason. Okay, whatever excuse it is. And this third mindset is really just more of a life lesson that I'm going to drop on you guys that I've learned from building my business, building a social media following, talking to a lot of women, anything you don't want to do, that is exactly the reason you should do it, right? So any excuse that comes up, that's why you should. Oh, I'm wearing a winter coat. I'm uncomfortable. I don't want to, I don't want to talk to her. Okay. That's exactly why you should. I'm nervous right now. I'm not in a good state. That's exactly why you should. Because imagine if your future wife was walking by and you were in a bad state and you had never practiced approaching in a bad state before. That's exactly why you should do it. You should do these things that make you uncomfortable. All the excuses that come up, start reframing those as these are reasons why I should. And if there's anything you walk away from this video with, it's just this mindset. I repeated this to myself for like a couple years when I was first learning game and it came from RSD Max back in the day. Big inspiration for me. If I feel resistance, I've got to do it. I have no choice. And I kept telling myself that all the time, over and over, even just walking down the street. I would be walking down the street like this, right? I'd be like, okay, if I feel resistance, I got to do it. And the next time I'd feel resistance, sometimes I'd do it, sometimes I wouldn't. But there's that once every week where I'd feel resistance and I'd approach the girl. And so it worked. It was very powerful. And then maybe twice a week that starts happening. I feel resistance and I do it. That's huge. And then eventually you're just a guy that you feel resistance and you're doing it all the time. You're approaching all the fucking time. That's huge. If you like this video and you want my help getting consistent dates, getting better with women, overcoming approach anxiety, I coach guys for $54 a month in the description on my YouTube channel. You can also apply for one-on-one -on -one mentorship, but I only take on one to two clients every week. So that is much more limited spots, a lot more expensive, but it's also faster results. I guarantee working with you until you get results. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Like, subscribe, comments, all that shit. Send this to your friends. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.